elite families and players. Uh, this is Derek Decatur here at Decatur Performance and Fitness, a couple doors down from, from the courts. Wanted to quickly talk to you about our summer program coming up for strength and conditioning. Summer is your time to, to really put in some work and get better for next season. Uh, you can work on nutrition, you can work on your strength, you can work on your power, you can work on your jumping. This is the time to start to improve and put that work in. Quickly wanted to go over what our program is. I'm going to try to keep it as short as possible just to give you a general overview. Sports performance training, different than just going to the gym. This wheel here represents what we believe is a well-rounded performance program. In the center of that wheel is the spoke. That's just hard work. Okay? All you guys are, are exceptional athletes, so I think we already have this piece in place. If you don't work hard, everything else doesn't matter. Right? So whether that's on the court or in the gym, hard work is the foundation of all of this. So we got that in the center. At the top, strength, power, and muscle mass. Strength and power being uh, pretty important for you guys. We need to be strong to be powerful. We need to train explosively so that you can make cuts, you can jump, and build that power profile. Flexibility, mobility, and stability kind of go hand in hand. The difference, flexibility simply being how far you can crank on something. Think about sitting and just stretching out a hamstring, right? Just pulling on the joint. That's a lot different than mobility and stability, which would be how far can I raise my leg. That's important because if you're more flexible than you are able to control, that can lead to issues down the road, whether we're talking about injury or just a lack of ability to use the range of motion you have, right? So that might limit your speed. It might limit your jumping ability if you don't have the range of motion needed to explode. Speed and jumping, I kind of threw together here. Speed and, and linear speed and lateral speed all work hand in hand. We are essentially trying to increase how much force you can put into the ground during that session. So think of a basketball. If I drop a basketball, it's going to bounce a certain height. If I take that same basketball and throw it into the ground, it's obviously going to bounce higher. All we did was change how much force we put into the ground. That's how you're going to run faster. That's how you're going to jump higher. Okay? It's a little more in depth than that, obviously, but again, overview. Change of direction. Very important on the court. How you can stop and accelerate, right? Both from a position standpoint, but also getting into the right spots to be the most successful in your change of direction. Okay? This again is some speed and, and, and power, um, but it's also kind of eccentric strength. How fast can you stop? The guy who can stop faster has the ability to accelerate faster. So instead of the guy getting by you, you're able to stop and accelerate quicker in the change of direction. Now one thing that might be a little different here is change of direction isn't a bunch of cone drills, right? We look at cone drills and ladders as almost more of a warm up. It's rehearsed. Uh, I don't think it translates into getting you better on the court. So our change of direction drills are much more reactive, right? You don't know what we're gonna ask you to do. You just have to find the right angles, find the right body position, and explode out of them. That's tr that translates into uh, being successful on the court. Nutrition and recovery kind of go hand in hand here. Again, this is why some are so important. You have time to train and do all these things. You have time to work on your nutrition. You have time to implement recovery strategies. If you don't recover well, you limit all of this, right? So recovery is huge. That can be sleep. That can be nutrition. That can be going and get a massage. That can be jumping in the ice. There's lots of things that help recovery, but it's a piece of this puzzle, and we talk about that quite a bit. Back to nutrition. We have a nutritionist on staff here. He will talk to all of our summer program athletes about sports performance nutrition. Sports skill is what you guys do all day long, right? It's vital to be a great player, but it's a piece of this puzzle, right? You have to get on the court, you have to work on your ball handling, you have to work on your, on your shooting. All those things that you've done your whole life must continue within this circle, within this wheel, okay? So just wanted to quickly show you what our summer program is about. Every workout, we hit all of this, except for the sports skill, okay? This is your coaches right here. Everything else, is what we're gonna be doing over the course of the summer. 
Um, we have two, we, or two day and three day programs for the whole summer. You can jump on decaturperformance.com. There's a link at the top to register for our classes with timeframes. If you have questions, feel free to shoot me an email uh, or stop over at the gym. Again, just a couple doors down from, from the courts.